Hi again people and a very very happy Sunday to you. Weather's not been too bad today. No the rest of the week has been absolutely woeful, raining. Yeah, but we're apparently supposed to be in for some nice weather, I believe so. That's if we believe the weather forecasters. Just a little update on how my ponds are doing. And as you can see, we've got some bags floating on top of the pond, which means one thing, some new additions. I've just uh, had a trip up over to Barnsley. I had to drop the wife and the kids off at the uh, airport this morning. Uh, after I've gone over to visit the wife's mum over in Sweden. Uh, now that they're able to fly, the wife hasn't seen a month there. Uh, it's coming on eight months now, so obviously with the lockdown that we haven't been able to get over to visit so um, she's gone over to um, spend some time with her mum for a couple of weeks so I've got two weeks at home on my own so I thought I'd take the opportunity to call over to um, see Chris at Coy Masters in Barnsley um, there was a nice shower I had my eye on the last time I went over to pick the Kajaku up and um, the plan was to go over to pick it up. Uh, now, unfortunately, that that um, shower had a bit of a um, bit of damage to its side, damaged scale. And Chris, being the person that he is, wouldn't let anyone take a fish what's not a hundred percent. So um, it did have a damage scale last time. We thought it would be healed by now, but it's still not right. So he never allowed me to take that one. But what it did give me, what it did give me, is an absolute, absolute beauty. Um, he's done me a real favour here because I travelled over to pick it up. He's actually give me a uh, lovely Madison shower out of his personal pond. Um, can't really see it now because it's in the bag, but it's an absolute stunner. Um, well pleased with it. Well, with the, the skin quality is unreal on it. And also, whilst I was there, I took the opportunity to pick up this little beauty. This is a nice Shiro Tori. Done me a real good deal on that because I bought this shower off them. But that's a lovely little Shiro, lots and lots of potential. And in the third bag, it's a little bonus bag. I'd um, been watching a shower on um, on eBay um, over in Sheffield. So I actually won the auction. I didn't think I'd put a bid in of £73. Uh, not thinking it would win, and it did. Um, 38 centimeter shower, Japanese from. Um, a gata. Yeah, I think I've actually no, I don't think it's not it's from from a gata actually, I'm not too sure. I'll have to have a look at the list and again. Um I know the Maritan shower and the Shiro uh, no, the Maritan shower is from a gata, the um Shiro is from Akawa. But it is a proper full Japanese shower. Um Nice, lovely fish. Needs a bit of work doing to it. It's still got a lot of potential for development. Um, looks a bit jaundiced on the head. I'm not too sure what the guy um, who had it was feeding. Um, his pond was was overstocked. It was heavily overstocked when I got there. You could see that. So obviously, it's been there's a number of fish you've been getting rid of. There was I was watching this one, and there was a few. I was also watching. Um, for sake of hacking, it had, it had a few black speckles on it, so we call we could call it a sankey. Um, but I ended up winning the auction for this seventy three pound for the thirty centimeter Japanese shower, and it's, it's, it's a real nice, nice fish. Um, I said, a bit of work to be done on it. I think I got, I'm not too sure what food he's been using, but I said there is a bit of jaundice, but there's a lot. 
I bought this one mainly for the potential on this. There's still got a lot of a lot of development to do. So just letting them acclimatise now and then we'll um, we'll get them bowled up and show you them properly. But yeah. Happy Sunday. So here we have two of the new arrivals. So and I think you'll agree they're absolutely stunners. The Maritan Shower from Agata. And we have got a Shiro Tsori from Kawa. Absolutely over the moon with them, especially that, that show. I've been after the show for a considerable amount of time now, and that is superb. It's actually a Maritime Kindai shower. Um, I know it's excellent quality because it was kept in Chris's main pond, and anything that goes into that pond is absolutely top quality. You won't have anything but in there. But yeah, they're them, the two from Koi Masters. Absolute stunners. So we'll get them in to the measuring bowl now and measure them up, see what we are, what they are. Looking at that shower, probably looking at about 45 cm, I'd say. Um, she all bought more for. Um, potential on, you know, and got a lot of potential on that one. I let Chris pick that one out for me because he's, you know, he knows a lot better than, what I'm, than me what I'm talking about. Um, I did have my eye on another one, it wasn't as big as that one, but Chris picked that one out for me. But over the moon with them too, absolutely. Well, conditions to the pond. This, this shower will be. Head and tails, the biggest in there now. I just wanted, you know, more size. I wanted in there really, but you know, you can speak to yourself. Everything on it is just so crisp, the sumi, the Benny, the Shiro. Shiro is it's like a, it's a nice white. But we'll get these measured up and then. Get them in the pond and let them settle down now because they've had a bit of a stressful journey. So, here's the third fish, another lovely shower from Ugata Koi Farm. Uh, another big fella to be honest, 38 cm, and I only paid for this one um, £73. I won the auction for. Um, but Bought more for potential. It's a bit, a little bit untidy at the moment, but I don't think. I think the thing with show is they don't show the sh true potential to the more Nissai stage, a bit, a bit older Sansai. So again, I think it was worth a, a punt at seventy-three pound. As I said, it looks as if it's got a bit of jaundice around its head. So hopefully we can get that cleared up. But yeah, we'll get this measured up now and get it in the pond. Uh, what I'm going to do with this one is give this a, a PP treatment before I put it in the pond. Uh, obviously I, I trust Chris Masters 100% uh, I know he wouldn't sell me a fish that's got any form of parasite or anything like that but um, just with this 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 fella now obviously the, the guy you bought him from I, I, you know, I don't know much about them at all, not about them at all, so um, I mean this pond was nice enough, it was just a bit overstocked, hence why it was for sale so um, we're going to give this PP treatment just a little dip for 3 to 4 minutes just to if it has got any parasites like you know, trichidine and anything like that it'll knock it off but, Another nice fish, but I'm really, really happy with it, especially for the money on this one. We have a gamble up for £73. So, here, yeah, Maritan Kindai Shower, 47 centimetres. Absolute peach. Let's get him into the pond now. 
Mosquito with Tori from Akawa Koi Farm and that one is coming out at 27cm another absolute peach so we got a shower and that one is 38 centimeters lovely fish let's get it in the pond so all settled in now nicely weather is absolutely atrocious up north don't know what it's like where you are but yeah only koi settled in all been up and feeding so happy days really happy with them yeah thanks again just masters of koi masters two superb new additions also my little wild card ebay purchase i'm really happy with but yeah um hoping the weather's gonna take off a little bit apparently we're gonna have another heat wave um in the second week of july so just hoping with fingers crossed but yeah folks i'll leave it at that because i said as you can probably hear by the wind, the weather is absolutely horrendous here. Feels more like a bloody winter day. Uh, but uh, we'll check back next week with another video on how the new koi are doing and what we were up to with the pond. Um, with an hour to everything, people. Um, I hope you're all doing well. Hope your ponds are all doing good. Uh, let me know what you've been up to and what you think of the um, the new koi. Um, big thank you again to all cunts and you subscribers are always, always appreciated but yeah that's it folks enjoy what's left of your weekend and i hope you have a good week that's coming stay safe 